So now I want to do something new, guys, though, for the show. It's going to be called the First and 49ers Gold Mine Film Analysis. That's right. I'm going to be start breaking down film on this show, guys. My expert analysis. And we're going to start off right now. I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to show you guys two plays that really stood out to me in this game right here. So let me share my screen. The first play is going to take place beginning of the second quarter for the Niners. Uh, you're going to see Jimmy G throw behind Brandon Ayuk. Awful pass. That's not really what we're focusing on here, though. We're going to focus on what happened at the end of the play. Ayuk was, was getting covered by Sneed. Okay, falls down right here. And then, boom, right here, right there. Somehow, Brandon Ayuk's hand just got stuck on, on Sneed's foot, on his shoe. And he couldn't he couldn't take his hand off. Just It was complete bizarre just you couldn't do anything about it and boom oh still stuck on his hand oh and then right there penalty it should be a penalty right there Steen smacks Brandon Ayuk in the head just because he accidentally had his hand on his foot guys uh I think it just got stuck on his foot there was nothing Ayuk could do about it and he, he Sneed didn't get a penalty flag on there so that's something that we really I think the chief the the officials really need to, to see, and Sneed gets, needs to get a penalty right there. It was third down after that. That should have been 15 yards for, I don't know, unnecessary roughness for Sneed. Should have got that penalty, guys, right there. So that was that was definitely one of the big plays I saw. And I don't know if we're going to see another replay of that. Let's see right here. Yeah, boom. Here's another replay of this. Has his foot by accident, and then boom, Sneed smacks him in the head. That's not cool. Oh, 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 my hand's stuck. My hand's stuck. Brandon Ayuk, my hand's stuck. Oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry. I didn't mean to. Oh, big hit by Sneed in the head. All right. We're going to transition here. Fourth quarter. Very beginning of the fourth quarter. We're going to get some motion here with Debo. Debo's going in motion. Jimmy's going to snap the ball. It's going to be a first down pass. Boom. Quick pass. Give it to Ayuk for the first down. Great play. We're not getting into that play, though. We're going in to what happened on the offensive line right here. Jimmy didn't have a lot of time to get the ball off because, as we can see right here, we got Mike McGlinchey on the right side of the line. And right here, defensive end Frank Clark. We're going to see what happens right here. Let's press play. We're going to see Frank Clark. He's going to be coming off the edge, exploding. And Michael McGlinchey is going to get absolutely obliterated by Frank Clark. He gets absolutely shoved over. Something that we continue to see with by Mike McGlinchey. Luckily, Jimmy was able to find IU quickly in that game, in that in that pass right there, and get the ball off for a first down. If he holds it for holds it for another second, Jimmy probably would also get obliterated. So yeah, boom, and McGlinchey just gets absolutely destroyed on that play, guys. Something that we've seen consistently with Mike McGlinchey, not a very great at the pass, at the pass coverage, guys, and it's just a big issue for him. But that was my film analysis, guys. Uh, definitely got great insight for me there on on the football, <laughs> on the th on the game called football. So 